All right, what is up? This is Slow Plays back in some more Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. So today, guys, we are coming back at it again with another anime-based transformation mod created by the homie Azura, and we got him base form Saiyan Saga Vegeta. So you guys are probably sitting here like, oh my goodness, Slow, it's just Vegeta. What's so special about him? Well, just you wait because we're about to get into the transformation. It's going to be extraordinary. I'm excited for it. So if you guys remember, I did a mod based on the Super Baby Great Ape sort of transformation uh, created by Azora as well. But you guys just got to go check him out down below. I feel like it's going to be like a similar sort of, uh, I guess, animation, maybe even the same animation. But this time with, uh, you know, Vegeta going Great Ape, it was really cool to see. And I'm excited to see how this one looks as well. Just to see, you know, if there's any differences. Plus, I gave him uh, a custom skill here. We have this planet bursting, busting Gallic gun or whatever it's supposed to be. I think it's planet busting Gallic gun. I can't even read, dude. <laughs> this is the thing. Like, I'm really far away from my monitor, so sometimes it's like I can't, I can't necessarily read every single little part. But if I ever make a mistake, I apologize. So, uh, yeah, I'm really excited for this episode. Um, basically, it has the great ape, ex like the exact great ape form. With, you know, the armor and everything and the blue colors for his, you know, like, undershirt, garments, whatever, the spandex, yeah. Uh, it's got everything on there. So, we're gonna go ahead and jump straight on to it. But before we do, my friends, if you could do me a huge, massive, colossal gargantuan favor and smash that like button. Let's try to reach 15 likes on this video. That would be so freaking amazing. And I would truly, really, really appreciate it. Plus, shows that you guys want to see more Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 content here on the channel. As well as a continuation of the mod series. And dope Vegeta mods like this. Yes, Kakarot. So we also have the Saiyan Saga Goku by Uchihaji. Decided to throw that on there as well. We'll probably do like a little bit of verses because people like it whenever I go into the versus mode at the very end. So I'm going to keep providing that for y'all. But usually when it's like a crazy massive transformation pack, I just try to keep it, you know, in the photo mode. So like I said, he pretty much has uh, two new skills that I just put on there. Uh, one of them being a normal skill, the heat dome attack, because it's kind of like the galaxy breaker in a way. So we're going to go ahead and try this out, man. I am very excited. Goku versus Vegeta, Saiyan Saga style. Going to make a little bit of a recreation here. And um, I love these like transformation mods that are always just like so well done and based off the anime. And even though I think this is actually straight from the Xenoverse, uh, I guess, like, story mode, that's what I'm assuming it's going to be. But, you know, he could have made it a little bit different. We'll definitely see. I wonder if he's going to say, burst open and mix. We'll have to see. <laughs> so, they're having their little, you know, interactions that they always do. You guys have heard it plenty of times before. But uh, I'm going to go and check and just see the moveset here, just the basic moveset. Again, it's always worth uh, checking if there's anything different. Looking like uh, it's just going to be the same sort of moveset. But I, I kind of just, like I said, I kind of like to open up the, you know, video in the battle with a little bit of fighting. You know, it's no fun just going straight into the transformation. You got to play with your feet a little bit. Am I right? Am I right? Watch so many people right now already in the comment section. Oh, guys, taking four years just to show off the map. It's It's like, okay, you can just fast forward the video. You know what I mean? <laughs> All right, so, um, yeah, just kind of looking at everything, man. Vegeta, base form Vegeta is just a fun character to use. I mean, I know it's like, you know, the normal stuff going on, but we got this Flash Strike, which I threw on there because it looks sick as all hell. And we have this Planet Busting Galley Gun. Yo, okay. So that's definitely a move I need to use from, uh, I guess, like, a far away, bro. Oh, my goodness. That is ridiculous. Holy crap. Okay, let me use it right here. Boom. Look at that, bro. Let me actually see how thick that beam is. That... That beam was looking pretty thick, bro. Like, it was a thick-ass beam. All right, let me get Goku all the way over here. This is the worst stage to showcase this on. All right, so let's do it right here because I feel like there's too many freaking rocks in the way. You can't even see anything. So I'm going to charge it up again. So we got this going down. Oh, wait, hold on. That's Super Galaga. Like wrong one. Wrong one. <laughs> That's the ultimate skill. No. That's the thing. I'm getting confused right now. All right, let's go over here. Let me try it from here. Planet Busting looks... This looks a lot more extraordinary than the one that uh is actually like the super gala gun which is crazy so this looks like it's like straight off based on um like the anime just like the overall appearance of it it's pretty nutty bro like look at this oh my goodness all right so let's see if we can actually zoom out of here if the camera angle will cooperate with me so it's going it's going it is a thick beam bro look at that do you see what i'm seeing my goodness all right i'm trying to zoom out properly here this one zoom or is this one zoom? No, that's that's tilt. Okay, this one seems to be 
the full-on zoom out whatever but yeah it's it's pretty big it's pretty long like no joke i i know that does not sound <laughs> that doesn't sound very right but yeah like look at that dude that is insane bro insane what are you insane switch over to goku here and he's just like he's just taking the beatings bro like honestly <laughs> Let's get him a little bit more centered over here. What else we got? What else we got? Let me see here. So we have the finish breaker. You guys have seen plenty of times before here. Uh, okay, that's actually backwards. Maximum charge. Just want to see the aura. So yeah, he does have the red aura, which is kind of nice. And then we also have, like I said, the super uh, Gallic gun, explosive wave, and heat dome attack, which is kind of like Galaxy Breaker. I feel like Galaxy Breaker, he grabs him, like throws him up, and then uses it, I think. I can't remember. Something like that. But, you know, if you're from the bottom... It works out! It freaking works out, dude! It's like Shaggy style! <laughs> I don't know why I was doing that voice. That was just random. Alright, guys. Let's do it. Let's actually do the transformation. I know that's what you're all here for. So I'm here to provide it. But we had to, you know, check out some things beforehand. So in 3, 2, 1, Tumbleweed style. Great 8 transformation. Alright, so looking like it's exactly like the one from, uh, I guess the burst open mix. From the actual, like, story mode. I, th I think that's where he took it from. But man... This is just so cool looking. It's awesome. Look at that, dude. Yes, that never gets old. Look at how well this is done, bro. And the best part is, yes, you can have full mobility and combos with him. And that's what I love about this mod is the fact that you can do that. The only problem is um, you're kind of like breaking the barrier here. And it does get a little bit too crazy. But he's got his moveset. He has his moveset. His tail gets a little bit happy there, but... As you can see, I'm using my basic moveset that Vegeta actually has. Let's go for, I guess, the uh, powerful combo here, the strong combos. Yeah, it's exactly like it, bro. That is, oh my god, that is so sick. I love this. So, we got this going on here. Let me go for a triangle, square triangle, if possible, if he'll let me. Let's see it. Boom, boom, boom. Yep. And he does it, bro. He does it. So, like, the rigging of it actually has the normal combos, which is really extraordinary. Then we have this one right here, which is, I think, the uh triangle square triangle one if i'm not mistaken so pretty cool can we actually use a grab yes we can use his nutsack grab except it's not really the nutsack grab this time it's kind of different but yes he actually does grab on and uses the blast that is awesome bro so he does have his own skills here as well the skill change we have of course got to have the boulder toss and the grade eight beam you know the stuff that you know a great ape should have i would love to see a mod that actually gives them and allows them to use like Gallic gun and stuff i think that'd be super sick i'm definitely sure that's possible but it's just really cool seeing the boulder break and all that good stuff here like it's this this just fits uh grade 8 vegeta and just vegeta base form vegeta from the saiyan saga a lot more than it did baby babies look great and everything but this one is just like man it's so sick look at that dude the grade 8 baby if i miss it i'll hit him with my asshole bro yo look at this hold up if i could do this frame by frame if i could do it hold up let me see look 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 <laughs> dude dude goku's in one of his ass cheeks bro or i guess uh one of his glutes i don't even know bro oh my god goku just got the major the major dump taken on him look at him look at him he's he's spinning oh no <laughs> that is great bro oh my goodness so we also have Hal. i don't even know how to use Hal. i don't i have no idea what is needed for that move i still never know I'm, i feel like maybe if anything it's gonna have to do with Maybe key, stamina, health. Uh, we'll go to danger. Let me see. Yeah, I, I, I freaking don't know, dude, honestly. How do you use how? Does somebody know if it's even possible? Do I need to be... Oh, wait. I saw I saw it glow for a second there. Maybe I need... Um, maybe I need, like, normal... Normal key or something? I don't know. Does this even drain key? It doesn't. I don't think it freaking does, bro. Hold on. Let me see here. If I use that... Yeah, his... his his key is glitch. I think I have to be lower key, maybe. That's why I can't use Hal. But, I mean, it's it's Hal. I mean, you guys have seen it before. It's not, like, anything too significant. But still, whatever. Um, The combos are great. The battle is sick. I want to use Goku and fight Great Ape uh, Vegeta here. So, let's actually, uh, let's actually do that right now, if possible. So, Goku got pretty destroyed here. Okay, can you just get up, Goku? Jesus Christ. All right. So, I'm going to get Vegeta down here. The camera angles get really effed up here. Because he's so massive. But if I can, can I actually do any damage to him? I think this mod, you can't actually... Yeah, he has no uh, like actual weakness. So that is the unfortunate thing here. If I go for the Kaioken here, that is beautiful. Go for uh, another one here. There we go. That looks awesome, bro. Oh my god, I love this. So 
We can go for the spirit bomb and spirit ball and all that good stuff. We'll mess around with photo mode. I'll go into versus mode. We'll just do, I guess, Vegeta versus Goku in a way. The problem is I would do him versus Great Ape Vegeta, but that won't work at all. <laughs> it really won't, unfortunately. So, yeah, whenever he loses all his health, he actually does revert back to his normal state, which is pretty cool. I have to say that is pretty freaking dope. So, there we go. Get him killed here. Beautiful stuff. So, I'm going to mess around with photo mode and the Great Ape transformations, and uh, I'll see you guys back in versus mode. All right, my friends, so here we go. We're going to be doing the Saiyan Saga recreation random battle just for fun here. And uh, I will definitely transform the Great Ape and just smack Goku up just for fun. Um, like I said, this is just, you know, something to add to the video at the very end because a lot of people always ask me to do just like the versus mode. So I was like, okay, you know what? Might as well. So I'm going to try and land a couple combos here and just do some work on my boy Goku. But the best part is whenever I'm going grade 8, that way we can actually see, like, everything go down. So, I think, I, I have a feeling that he, he might not have super armor. That's the thing. So, I want to check if he actually does. So, I'm going to do that. I'm going to slap him out of here. Do a little bit more damage if possible. All right, come on, let's get it. No, 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 Goku. I'm going to get you from behind, bro. Stop it. Stop it. That's right. You're going to get your stamina broken like an idiot. So, let's see if I have super armor with this, if he can do anything. If he can't hit me, then we have a problem here. Because this animation takes at least 300 years just to do. <laughs> Alright, so, so far, so good. It's working. I think mid-animation, as long as I'm this far in, I can't lose. I can't lose now because I'm a great ape. Alright, I see Goku trying to use that spirit bomb. So, uh, I'm actually trying to see, do I do any more damage than I did previously? I feel like I do the same amount of damage, <laughs> honestly. Uh, it's just so weird seeing him being able to use normal combos and stuff. It just doesn't look natural. So, I'm going to go for that. Oh my god, Boulder Toss actually does... A crap ton. All right, let's go for this super great eight beam here. It's very hard to land because it's in such a weird angle and spot. So probably gonna have to do a little bit of this. Hit detection isn't awful. It's not too bad. The thing is, I have unlimited keys, so I'm trying to freaking land this if possible. He can still do damage to me, but I have like massive super armor, so he literally can't like can't even hit me. Honestly, so that's the thing. If this was like an expert mission, look at how big his forehead is. You know, Vegeta has a massive forehead, and you know that's Vegeta whenever he's got that widow's peak. But come to think of it, every single great ape looks like that, if I'm not mistaken. Like every single great ape has the same sort of massive widows. They all kind of look like Vegeta whenever they go great ape. Even Goku looked like that. I don't know if that's just because you know. Vegeta just looks like a great ape in general, if that's what they're trying to, you know, insinuate there, but whatever, I digress. So, hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode of the mod series. Big shout-outs again to Azota for creating this amazing, beautiful custom mod. Uh, like I said, it's pretty much the same thing as the one from Super Baby Vegeta, but it's cooler to see it on this version of Vegeta, the original. That's where it all kind of, you know, really, really started in terms of, like, you know, the burst open and mix kind of animation. I know Great Apes are in Dragon Ball, the original Dragon Ball, but I'm just saying, like, Vegeta, I feel like, is the most iconic one. Plus, I think it'd be cool if we got a Gohan one. Yo, Azoto, if you're watching this, can you make a kid Gohan transformation one? I think that'd be so sick, bro. Oh my goodness. Okay, I don't know what I'm trying to say. But in all seriousness, thank you all so much for watching. Leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it. And of course, of course, be sure to subscribe to the channel. I would truly appreciate it. Ring that notification bell to know when a new video goes live. And I shall see you guys in the next one. Get high for E3. It's coming soon. Love y'all. Peace.